strategy of the month, January 2026. Happy New Year, everyone. Today, we are going to look at a fantastic mean reversion trading approach for the gasoline futures market. Let's start by looking at the system's long-term performance. If we jump into the trade station trading platform and we bring up a strategy performance report for this systematic trading system, the first thing that we're going to see is this nice upward sloping equity curve. This equity curve shows us that this system has been fairly in tune with the gasoline futures market over the past 15 years. And it's been especially in tune with moves in the gasoline futures market recently. We can see that this equity curve has taken a nice leg higher here over the past few years. If we jump into a performance summary, we can see a total net profit for this system of about $105,000 with a profit factor of 2.87. Scrolling down slowly to our drawdown statistics, we can see a intraday peak to valley drawdown of about $13,000 per contract trade close to trade close of about $9,000 per contract. Both of those seem pretty reasonable along the way to again make about $100,000 in profits per single contract of gasoline traded over the past 15 years. And here are our symbol settings for gasoline that we are using. We're using gasoline 165 minute bars going back to 2010. And here are the properties for this system. You'll notice that we always include those realistic costs of slippage and commissions. In this case, $37.50 on average to get in and out of a contract of gasoline and look inside bar back testing enabled. So if you want to replicate these results, we'll look at the full system code in a second, but if you want to replicate these results for yourself in a platform like TradeStation or MultiCharts, there are all the strategy settings as well. And if we look at annual returns for this systematic trading approach for the gasoline futures market, we can see that this strategy has had decent performance over the past 15 years. This strategy has had positive returns in 11 of the past 14 full calendar years. It had a few years of underperformance from 2017 to 2019, but it has made money in six of the past six years. Average annual returns of $8,400 per contract, which represents about a 54% average return on 2.5 times margin. And speaking of margin and notional contract size, Gasoline is a relatively average size contract. A gasoline futures contract notional value is about $74,000 in value and only requires about $5,000 of margin to trade. So if you are new to systematic trading, if you have a relatively small account size, gasoline could fit into your portfolio fairly well. And if we bring up a gasoline price chart, a price chart for gasoline 165 minute bars, we can get a real sense for how this strategy works. This looks like it is a mean reversion strategy. So the strategy most recently was selling at higher levels and if we look back a few months strategy sold at high levels strategy bought at lower levels so it looks like through time this strategy is trying to buy dips and it's trying to sell rallies so this is some sort of mean reversion approach to trading the gasoline futures market which as we can see from a lot of these teal lines which represent positive profit trades suggests that this approach to trading gasoline has been pretty in tune with what the gasoline market has been doing over the past few quarters. So this is a mean reversion approach to trading. We can see that from the price chart. We can see from those performance statistics that it's been fairly in tune with the market recently. Let's look at what the code shows us. Let's bring up the actual code written in the easy language coding language. There it is. There's the full system code logic that we need to run this systematic trading approach for the gasoline futures market. The first thing that is going to jump out to us is that we are defining this variable here, this Z score variable, and we are using it to 
buy dips and sell rallies in the gasoline market. We know this because for our long entry, we are looking for situations in which Z score is below a Z entry level. And we are for the short entry looking for situations for that Z score is above that Z entry level. So we are trying to buy dips and we are trying to sell rallies in gasoline futures. We can see that there are also some filters before both of the buying and sell short entry. There is a CCI cross filter before the long entry. There's a MACD as well as January and March filter before the selling short entry. As a reminder, you can find these filters as part of our thousand filters package available at peakalgo.com. There's a simple exit here that also uses Z scores to exit if it reverts to zero. But overall, this is a fairly simple filtered mean reversion approach to trading the gasoline futures market. And as we saw via all those teal lines on the chart, as we saw via that performance report, we know that this is a pretty effective approach to trading gasoline futures. So that is it. That is our January 2026 strategy of the month. It's a consistently positive trading approach for the gasoline futures market. I really like this upward sloping equity curve. Recently, it had a period of underperformance here, 2017, 2018, 2019. But as we can see from our trade list here, this strategy has had six consecutive positive trades. It's had uh, positive profits in eight of the past nine trades. Again, we can see a lot of teal lines here. The strategy generally does a good job of buying dips and selling rallies, especially over the past few years. This looks like a pretty solid approach to trading the gasoline futures market. So let me know what you think about this filtered mean reversion trading approach to the gasoline futures market. Do you like this system? Do you have a better trading system for the gasoline market? Leave me a comment below. Remember, you can always find those filters that we use to build this system at peakalgo.com. I am really excited for all the great systems that are ahead of us to share in 2026. Remember to hit like and subscribe so you don't miss out on more great stuff from Peak Trading Research. Have a great start to your new year. Good luck trading gasoline futures and we'll see you soon.